Craig here and in today's short video tutorial I'm going to be showing you how to fix the 400 bad request error. Now this error is related to some form of a corrupt cookie or something along those lines. So earlier today I was trying to create a new blog post for my website thewiseaffiliate.com and then I went to hit update and lo and behold as soon as I hit the update I got that stupid 400 bad request error. So I've decided to create a quick video and show other people how to fix this problem if you get it too. Now the reason you get it with WordPress is because when you log into the admin area a cookie is set and if the cookie becomes corrupt then it doesn't really know who you are and you get this 400 bad request error. So I'm in Google Chrome and I'll show you how to fix it on uh, Google Chrome, Firefox and Internet Explorer. Okay so in Chrome we're going to come over to the settings icon scroll down all the way to settings then we're going to scroll down and we're going to click on show advanced settings and then we're going to click on content settings under privacy and then we are going to click on all cookies and site data now if you're like me and you don't delete your cookies very often it may take a while for this pop-up to load so now this is going to list all of the different cookies that we have stored in our Google Chrome you know temporary folder whatever you want to call it so I'm going to type in the wiseaffiliate.com because that is my domain name and you can see we have a whole bunch of cookies so I'm just going to remove them all so remove all press done and I'm going to come back over to my blog and we'll hit refresh and now I should be granted with my login page there we go so now I can log in I'm hoping that my post uh, you know the auto save has kicked in and I haven't lost the post which I was trying to update okay so jumping over to Firefox pretty much the same thing uh, if the start page looks like this you can access the settings down here or we can come up to here and we can go to options and then options and we jump over to the privacy tab and you can clear you know clear all your browsing data and that will fix it or you can remove individual cookies so again you start to type out your domain name whatever it is and remove all cookies close that will fix the problem now Internet Explorer I do not use Internet Explorer and I believe the version I have here is Internet Explorer 9 or something like that uh, I don't recommend Internet Explorer to anyone but if you use that I believe when you actually close the browser by default it deletes all the cookies and your temp files however if you still have this problem you simply come over to your tools internet options and then under the general tab you can click on settings alternatively you can click on delete make sure everything is checked and just delete all of the temp files etc or you can come to settings click on view files this is going to open up the folder with all of your temp stuff and your cookies and basically you'd have to locate the cookie for your website that's given you the 404 bad request error so that's it for this tutorial I hope it helps questions or comments feel free to post them below and if you like this video feel free to check out my other tutorials covering WordPress uh, have yourself a great day